It was made official on the day before signing day. Caleb Williams to USC. Does it change anything for you? Does it surprise you? Like, what what did you think of it? I Here's the deal. My, my immediate reaction, I want somebody to sit this young man down, and I need an explanation as to why the fuck you took two months to make a decision that we all kind of assumed you were going to make to begin with. I would love to, to get an interview with him to hear. Like, just I, need what... a, I just need to know for my own sanity, this was the easy decision. This was the choice everybody assumed you were going to make. Did you just want two months without going to school? Now, and that's fine. Hang on. If that's the answer, I'm cool with that. I hated school. I was terrible at school. I understand it. But I need to know. I need to know because I lay in bed at night wondering, what in the hell is this kid doing? I'm, I'm curious myself. What kind of recruiting um, class could they have gotten had, had other guys known Caleb was coming and was going to be yeah. there? And all like, like, that's a big part of recruiting, by the way. That's a real big part of recruiting. Oh, yes. Oh, 100%. I do wonder if, I mean, it really appeared that they were just doing their due diligence. They were studying, making sure that they made the right choice. I respect you know, that, man. It, and I get it. It don't take two months to do this. Agreed. It just Agreed. don't. And you're like, okay, you want to come down to Baton Rouge because we were number two to OU when you originally, you know, going to school as a, as a senior and high school being recruited. And that's fine. I appreciate it. Like, a friend of your dad's gets hired at Wisconsin, you can go play for Paul Chris, and you think you want to be prepared for the NFL? Like, like man, y'all better be real good friends. You know, Wisconsin, <laughs> right now is a shitty part of the year to want to go hang out in Wisconsin, bro. Oh, yeah. Oh, like, yeah. January's got to be the worst month to be in Wisconsin, right? I mean, we saw the, the soccer game in Minnesota where it was, what, like negative 20 windshield or whatever? Yes. Windshield? What are we doing? Yeah. What are we doing? Listen. January, uh, February. You just avoid like the middle northern part of the country, okay? Like we just cut this big ass swatch out, and nobody goes there. Very easy, at, at least you would think. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at Gary WCE at Chris B Giannini at Winning Cures, or you can email us Gary at Winning or Chris at Winning Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.